Today we're diving into something that will change the way you think about attraction. We're talking about the secrets that make 99.8% of women get turned on. Trust me you don't want to miss this. Most guys think the way to a woman's heart is through compliments, gifts, or being overly nice. But the reality? Those tactics often backfire. Women are turned on by something much deeper, an emotional experience that triggers their desire instinct. Stick with me, and I'll share five powerful words that you can start using today to create that irresistible attraction. But before we get into the magic words, let's talk about the feelings that actually turn women on. It's not about being nice or showing compatibility. It's about eight feelings that I'm gonna discuss quickly. One, challenge. Women are often turned on by a mental challenge. When they feel like they have to work a bit to win your attention or affection, it creates a sense of excitement and intrigue. This doesn't mean being distant or playing hard to get excessively, but rather not being too available or too easy to please. Two, intimacy. Creating an intimate vibe is a powerful way to turn a woman on. This includes making her feel understood, appreciated, and emotionally connected. Physical closeness, meaningful conversations, and sharing personal experiences can foster this intimacy. 3. Tension. Sexual tension or general tension can be very arousing. This could be the excitement that comes from a playful argument, the anticipation of physical contact, or even the nervous energy that comes from a new and exciting interaction. 4. Ambiguity. A little bit of uncertainty can be intriguing and attractive. When a woman isn't entirely sure where she stands with you, it creates a sense of mystery and keeps her engaged. This doesn't mean being unclear about your intentions, but rather not laying everything out too soon. 5. Playfulness. Fun and playfulness are incredibly attractive. Light teasing, playful banter, and a sense of humor can create a relaxed and enjoyable atmosphere that turns a woman on. It shows that you're confident and not taking things too seriously. 6. Confidence. Confidence is universally attractive. When a woman sees that you're confident in who you are and what you want, it's very appealing. This confidence should come from self-assurance and not arrogance. 7. Respect. Respecting yourself and respecting her is key. When you set boundaries and show that you value yourself, it signals to her that you're a high-value individual. Respecting her opinions, space, and boundaries also makes her feel safe and valued. Number 8. Masculinity. Displaying traits traditionally associated with masculinity, such as strength, decisiveness, and protectiveness, can be very attractive. This doesn't mean adopting a macho persona, but rather being assertive, taking the lead in situations, and showing that you can be relied upon. Now let's get into the five words that create irresistible attraction with women. The first word is no. Sounds simple, right? But it's incredibly powerful. When you say no, you're asserting your boundaries and showing self-respect. Imagine this. You walk up to a cute girl at a bar, and five seconds into the conversation, she asks you to buy her a drink. Most guys would jump to please her, but the attractive move? Say no, let's talk first. If it goes well, maybe then I'll buy you a drink. This creates challenge and tension, making you instantly more attractive. When you say no, you assert your boundaries and show that you respect yourself. This self-respect is attractive because it signals that you have standards and aren't desperate for approval. Women find it attractive when a man knows what he wants and isn't afraid to stand up for himself. Saying no introduces an element of challenge. When you don't immediately agree to everything, it creates a sense of intrigue and makes the woman work a bit harder for your approval. Word number two, sexy. This word creates intimacy and tension, but here's the trick. Use it playfully and unexpectedly. For example, tell her she has a sexy elbow or a sexy earlobe. It's unexpected and playful, diffusing any awkwardness while still bringing intimacy into the conversation. Use sexy in a lighthearted, playful manner. Instead of directly calling her sexy, try combining it with something unexpected to create a fun and flirty vibe. The timing and setting are important. Use sexy when the conversation has already turned flirtatious or when you're in a more private or intimate setting. Avoid using it too early or inappropriately, as it might come off as insincere or too forward. Word number three, trouble. Giving her a playful nickname like trouble creates a unique bond. It's challenging and fun, making her feel like you have a special connection. Remember, he who names owns. This nickname creates an intimate vibe, and it's something she'll remember. 
Referring to her as trouble can also be seen as a subtle challenge. It suggests that she's not easy to handle or predict, which can pique her interest and make her want to prove herself to you. Imagine playfully saying to a woman, you're trouble, you know that? Every time I'm around you, I find myself getting into all sorts of mischief. This kind of statement combines flirtation with a hint of challenge, creating an intriguing dynamic that can be very appealing and turn her on. Word number four, little. This one taps into evolutionary psychology. When you call a woman little in a flirtatious way, you're emphasizing her femininity and your masculinity. For example, saying you're so little with a smile creates a sense of protection and intimacy. Just be sure to use it in a lighthearted, non-patronizing way. Imagine saying to a woman, you're so little when you stand next to me. It's adorable. This kind of statement combines a compliment with a hint of flirtation, creating a dynamic that can be very appealing and turn her on. When used in a flirtatious context, the word little can have a suggestive undertone that adds a playful and teasing element to your interaction. This can help build sexual tension and increase attraction. Word number five, friend. This word introduces ambiguity and mental challenge. Let's say you've been flirting and things are going well. Throw in a casual, you're such a cool friend. I should introduce you to someone. It makes her wonder about her status with you. This uncertainty can create intrigue and make her more interested in exploring a potential romantic connection with you. When a woman hears the word friend from someone she's attracted to, it can trigger a desire to change that perception and become more than just friends. She may want to prove herself to you and show you that she's worthy of being seen as more than just a friend. There you have it. These five words, no, sexy, trouble, little, and friend, are powerful tools to trigger the desire instinct in women. Start using them in your conversations and watch the magic happen. If you found this video helpful, hit the like button, subscribe for more tips on attraction and relationships, and leave a comment below about which word you're excited to try out. And remember, it's all about creating those emotional experiences that make you unforgettable. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.